beauties and welcome to my fitness routine video. So the first thing I do when I begin my fitness routine is I sort out my clothing. Now I obviously want something that's very suitable for a workout and even though I do work out from home sometimes, I definitely want to look the part because it's beneficial to the task. Now I tend to feel very comfortable and move more freely wearing tights, so I've chosen this stretchy comfortable tights from Zumba.com and I've teamed it up with this crop top because obviously girls, we need the support. You have to admit. <laughs> and I'm also pairing them up with these shoes that are very flexible and very easy to move in. Now I've got these from Zumba.com. They are the same brand as the dance class, so they may look a bit familiar, but I'll put the link below. And you can also get 20% off your order by using the code STYLIST20, but I'll put all the information below as well. And also, if I'm doing my workout outside, I make sure to wear sunscreen, and I usually stick to something that's not as oily. Now, because I do work out daily, I was recently introduced to this dietary supplement by Isaway Sports called the Electrolyte Formula, and it's in the pineapple flavor. And I've been taking this for the past two months, I would say. I pretty much have this during or before my workout just to give me that extra bit of energy. And what it does is it replaces your fluids and your electrolytes that support your energy. So if you're feeling dehydrated or anything like that, it will give you energy back. So I just mix two scoops with a bottle of water and then I'm good to go. So right before my workout, I obviously do a few stretches and things like that and deep breaths. I feel like that helps me get into the mood of my workout. And the one thing I would have to say my biggest tip would be to wear comfortable clothing, wear something that's going to help you, you know, do that exercise, do that workout. So obviously what I've chosen is something that, you know, it's going to help me. The fabric's going to help me stay dry and it's going to help me work out. Now welcome to my workout. So I tend to start jogging for about two minutes to get my heart rate up. And then once that is done, I do about 25 lunges on each leg. Now this can get a bit painful, but it's very, very worth it. Let me assure you that. <laughs> now once that is done, I do two minutes of these frog jumps. Now if you know me, you would know that I've been doing it Saturday for a few years, so that's where I've gotten these inspirations from, but I do two minutes of that. And then once that is done, I would say I would do about 50 high kicks. Once again, this isn't very easy, but you know, it definitely is worth it. And then I do about walking planks for about three minutes. And I try and rotate evenly on each arm just to get the muscle strength and, you know, everything even. <laughs> I have a bit OCD like that. And then I do the running man, which is pretty much like a plank position. But you continuously run on the same spot. And then after that, I do my side lunges. I would probably say I do about 25 on each side. If I'm feeling very adventurous, I try and do 50 on each side. Now once that's done, I do high kicks for about two minutes and I try and get my knees up to where my hands are, which can get a bit difficult, but I try my best. And then one of the last things that I do is a high jump, plank or a burpee, whatever you like to call it, for about three minutes, which is the most painful, but it's worth it the most. <laughs> Now one of the last workouts that I do and one of my favorites is this cross turn for about three minutes and this is perfect for your ab area and generally speaking your thighs. It hurts so much but it's worth it. <laughs> and then last but not least I obviously stretch. Don't forget to do this because you can cause serious injuries if you don't. So make sure I stretch for a good minute. <laughs> Now I like to think of my workout as helping my body on the inside, but I always like to do the same thing on the outside. So while I do workout, I also like taking care of my skin. Now that's why, just to cool down and just get my body back to reality, I like to drink this tea from your tea. And this is the one in the skin one, so it's called the Skin Magic Tea. And it pretty much cleanses your system and just washes out all the toxins or anything like that, just staying back in your body. And I feel like this is something good to do while you're working out because if you're taking care of your body, you might as well take care of it completely and 100%. So I tend to have this drink after my workout, but right before my meal. You may need to have this 30 minutes before your meal just for it to settle down in your stomach. So I tend to do that. And sometimes I mix a bit of honey with it as well. I really hope you guys enjoyed my video. Comment below what you do and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Until next time, I love and adore each and everyone. Bye.